Okay, so you have a 135mm bike frame and a 120mm track hub and you want to uh, make those two things work together. Right. So here's how I achieved it. I added some extra spacing bolts on either side of the hub. Normally you have quite a bit of thread left here on a 120mm um, frame. So all you do is you add some extra spacers here and then you add, um, you just put it in the frame. Um, and what you need to do is you need to try and align the middle um, of, hang on let's have a look. So you need to align the middle of the tire to the middle of the frame, right? Now the most important bit of any, ow, hang on wait. Now the most important bit of any single speed bike is the chain line um, and this is going to provide you with a lot of limited options. So for example you can technically do this without a chain tensioner um, but it's called a unicorn gear. Um, you have to have a very specific front and rear gear um, and in my case I don't think that would have been a good option and I'll show you why in a second. Okay, But effectively I've used um, Um, I've just used the, um, so there's two sides of the track hub, I've used the one where I could get further out with the sprocket at the back, I've used um, a chain tensioner and I've had to buy a new set of cranks because the existing set of cranks wouldn't work because the chain line was too far out. So you can see what I've done, what I've done is I've brought um, this new set of cranks and I've mounted the chain ring behind the cranks to give me a better chain line. Um, but check this out you can see that there's literally, no, I, can't, I can't even get a fingernail between um, this 44 tooth chain ring and the frame itself. Um, and actually there's a bit of paint scratched or chain oil on there. So where the chain's got slightly dirty is then rubbed off on the frame. That's how close it is to the frame, right? So that's basically what you do. You add additional spaces to the hub on the back um, you check, make sure you've got a straight chain line, which might involve getting a new crank set. Um, pretty dedicated, right? Um, and you probably need to get yourself a chain tensioner. Okay. So chain, so um, spaces on the rear hub, chain line, um, get it as good as possible, and you're away. You've got a fixed gear 35 millimeter frame bike like me. Now, what I will say is, if you go back. Like, I don't know, if you go back a few shorts in my videos, YouTube shorts, such a weird name, um, you'll find where I tried to do this bike basically for free. So I tried to keep the original crank set, I tried to use an old derailleur as a chain tensioner, um, I tried to use just a nine speed chain I had hanging around, um, and I could just not, no matter what I did, I couldn't get that set up to work, it was too difficult. So in the end, um, I went to AliExpress, and I, it's, I'm just super bougie, uh, I don't know what to tell you. Uh, I went to AliExpress and I brought the crank set, the chain ring and the chain tensioner. And the crank set was actually on offer. So bottom bracket, crank set, chain tensioner and chain ring cost me something like $25. Um, it was literally nothing. Um, so what I would say to you is if you're looking to do on the cheap, um, go to the house of AliExpress um, and get your get your stuff there um, because I tried to do it like I've got all the parts in the garage to do the cheap version and it just wouldn't work yeah um, just go out and spend that little bit of money um, and this is reliable as anything I did 25 kilometers on this yesterday morning um, no problem whatsoever no chain drops or anything like that um, so yeah I think the $25 was well worth it considering I couldn't go a meter without dropping a chain on sort of the super ghetto setup. Uh, but with this setup, I can do 25, 30 kilometers. Not an issue. Okay. So I wish you the best of luck with your conversion. Um, don't give up chain line, chain line, chain line. If the chain's dropping, it's because your chain line's off. Yeah. Um, 
So just try and get your chain line as straight as possible. Use single speed components. Um, you'll be fine. Okay? All right, peace.